Hey guys, so the day has finally come after giving my family lots of hints. Finally got the Ryobi cordless reciprocating saw and uh, we're going to unbox it, give it a review. Now here it says works with all 18 volt batteries. That's one 18 volt. 5.0 that's an 18 volt 2.5 we'll give both a go um, both are pretty much charged charged so let's see what we have in here we're given uh, two different provided with two different saws I guess that's the wood one the small finer teeth I'm guessing is for metal and other harder objects so that's the saws get your manual okay so the first thing is let's have a look at this you see that bit that is what they call the anti-vibe technology so when you're moving around it gives you like a minimal movement that's where our battery goes it's pretty straightforward design that's where you would hold it and this is the flip you use uh, the switch you use to put in the saw now apparently in some of the reviews I've seen the guy was like it broke for them pretty quick and this one I can see it doesn't even stay there so I have to actually Hold it and then put in the saw. And then once it's in, it's pretty good. This shoe, apparently you need um, some kind of Allen key. The Allen key is over here. So we can use that. And what you do is loosen that guy. And then you can move this. Only thing, only issue is, again, it's very short. So even if you wanted to make the most of um, the saw, <coughs> there's not a lot you can jiggle about. that shoe moves a little bit so you do have a bit of give there and let's just tighten everything and give it a go and then key goes in there boom now safety first so let's think about what we're doing first are we putting the battery first? Are we putting the saw first? I'll go with the saw first. So there's no power on the thing. Let's see if I can do it blind. Nope, I need to look. I'm not sure if you can see that. That's where the saw goes. And then it locks in. Yeah. Okay. Battery number one. Hold it the right way. Give it a soft squeeze. Now. Whoa. That is a bit scary. So you can go slow, you can go faster, and I haven't even pressed the full thing because my family is sleeping, but let's give it a quick squeeze. Oh my gosh. Now we're going to try the bigger battery, which is 5.0 AH, whatever that stands for. There shouldn't be much of a difference. Oh, actually, that's a bit s 
stronger. It's got a faster pick. Okay. So to make it work, depending on which hand you use, you'd use your thumb to activate the safety or release the safety and then so if you do it without nothing happens and the buttons on both sides so left and right hands both work now I have quite a few projects which I need to do with this so I will be making future videos by the time this review comes out um, hopefully I've uploaded also those projects or at least some kind of projects again Ryobi if you're watching I would love a pressure washer, a hand vac or a multi-tool and I'll do more reviews on those also but anyway even if Ryobi doesn't send me stuff um, I'm going to build my collection with them because I like their stuff and yeah you'll see some more videos on that. See you soon!